Today, in honor of National Bread Month, a special guest is here to show us how to make some gourmet dishes at home. He's known as the Holla King of Beverly Hills. Chris Brugler is here with some simple recipes for chocolate bread pudding with ice cream and raspberry sauce. You're watching KCAL 9 News at noon. All you bread lovers out there, you know who you are. Time to celebrate because November is National Bread Month. Did you know that, Sandra? I didn't know that, but I'm going to celebrate <laughs> the Yala King of Beverly Hills. Chris Brugler is here. He's going to celebrate with us. He's also going to show us how to make some delicious recipes with Hala. Welcome, Chris. Thank you for having me. What the heck is Hala? <laughs> Hala bread. So it's traditional Jewish bread. Uh -huh. um, been around for thousands of years, and I'm here to put a twist on it. Oh, You've oh, kind of modernized it and put updated it. How did that happen? Um, I was a private chef for a family in Beverly Hills and uh, the children wanted different varieties of challah bread. So to keep them interested every Friday, we created different flavors. Um, and the white chocolate was the favorite. Really? Mm -hmm. That's so People sweet. don't feel as guilty eating it. <laughs> <laughs> these are all the different in ingredients that you can put in it? Yes, these are just a few. We have uh, 11. Total. So this is uh, dried apricot, milk chocolate, dried cranberry, and white chocolate. And uh, do you pick one of those, or can you combine them all? Um, you can kind of create your own today. What are you making here? Um, this is Black Mission Fig grilled cheese with uh, brie, caramelized onion, and basil. And what, oh, what kind of hollow bread is that? Uh, this is Black Mission Fig. Okay, that's it's right there in the bread. That's your yes. version of a grilled cheese. Huh? Yes, <laughs> and it's, a, very it's a big winner uh, when we do our catered events. We wow. just did a big one for DreamWorks, and this was the number one hit. That's so hollow bread, it sounds like now we have more appeal. <clears throat> um, yes, and a lot of... Uh, and it's I for mean, everyday hala, eating. Exactly, make every day a holiday. Hala oh. actually, uh. <laughs> <laughs> actually has a lot of uh, health, health benefits as well, a lot of fiber. Um, and actually, if you eat a slice before bed, um, helps you sleep, believe it or what? not. What? Really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right. We hear so much about carbs being bad for you. but Especially in L.A., yes. There is a role for bread in your diet. Right. There is. And um, the, the bread freeze as well. So a lot of people who buy it, they'll either you know, eat what they want for that Friday night or whatever day they're having mm -hmm. it. And then it makes amazing French toast, which we have right here. Ooh, this is a uh, Ghirardelli white chocolate hollow <sighs> French toast. Oh my oh, goodness. Yeah, maple good. scented maple syrup. Yeah. Show us how to make something here. Okay. So in here we have Sandra's the, anxious to eat some. <laughs> exactly. In Never here mind we the have making. The, Let's uh, just dig in. <laughs> the white chocolate. And what you do is you cut hey, be your careful. bread <laughs> into three different uh, bowls. Okay. And then you roll it out into three different coils. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be a mini one. These make great uh, party favors for weddings. We do a lot of this. Because you and aren't all a king. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and then to braid, which actually the daughters that I worked with taught me how to braid. Oh, is that right? <laughs> yes. And girls are good at that. <laughs> exactly. You're just going to marry them in the middle. It can kind of be like Play-Doh. I'm going to check your grilled cheese. Perfect. You're hired. Oh. Sandra's burning it. No, no. no. So it's, <laughs> just, it's just a regular braid. Though. Exactly. Regular braid. And then you marry them together at the end. It's important because if... You don't marry it together. Once it expands and rises, it's going to be a no-no. <laughs> I'll go off in different ways. And this is a mini braided white chocolate challah. And you would let this rise for about 30, 40 minutes and then egg wash it. And then bake it for about 40 minutes and this is your final product. How do you decide what ingredients go well together? Um, it's just kind of trial and error. I mean, <laughs> I love sweet. Um, so a lot of the, well also besides the Black Mission fig, we would use um, dry cranberry and walnut with like a gorgonzola. I make an amazing braised short rib that we do mm. a grilled cheese with gorgonzola, um, pickled onions, and basil. And that's another crowd and, pleaser. And what about the dough itself? What, what's actually in that? The dough itself, um, flour, sugar, salt, yeast, um, margarine, and water, and the rest I can't tell you. I oh. think we should try. I think we should try one. You want to try one? Perfect. Okay, so you're gonna want me to cut it in three for you? Please. Yeah. I'm dangerous with knives. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you better do that. And then we're just gonna go for it, Sandra. Roll it out. You're all helping right. rolling out. Okay, thank you, Dave. You gotta do it fast, like the, oh, like the holocaust yes. does. <laughs> Whoa, mine's not rolling very well. I think you gave no, me a broken one. <laughs> <laughs> I need like got to get on that thing and no, roll it. Yeah, don't you? you do. It takes a little bit. You got to use to those muscles. I think mine's better than yours, Sandra. Look at <laughs> oh, nice. Yours is perfect. Look at that. 
Okay, marry mine now. Okay, now we're oh. ready. Okay, perfect. When, when do I get to add the chocolate? Um, you should have already. So you're making oh. a oh. no. You're making a plain a okay. sesame or a poppy seed. Absolutely, that's what she was planning on. <laughs> She's making a plain. Perfect. Uh, marry the ends. Otherwise, you end up with some real trouble. I wasn't trouble. paying attention during yeah. that no, part. No, that's perfect. You marry it together. And yeah. It's kind of. Yeah. See? Kind First of. time. Bake Out it the for gate, how long? Good. What temperature? Uh, this is going to bake for about uh, 40 minutes. 40 at minutes 400 at, degrees. At 400 degrees? Yes. And you end up with something as beautiful this, yep. as this. Exactly. Mine's kind of well, lumpy. King. <laughs> Let's all give a holla for the holla king. <laughs> Thank holla you very much for being here. All right, That's for more best. information about the recipes and the holla king, just go to kkl9.com. You can click Scene on TV.